Every beginner has their share of mistakes, but what if you could avoid them before they even happen? My name is Rana with EditingCorp.com and in this video, I am going to share with you the 10 things every beginner video editor should steer clear of. Number 1. Using every effect and transition When you are just starting out with video editing, it's super exciting to see all those cool transitions and effects. I mean, there are so many in the software, but just because they are there doesn't mean you got to use them all. In fact, if you go overboard with those fancy transitions, your video might end up looking kinda amateur. It's usually best to keep it simple. Stick with the basic cuts and fades. Trust me, they never go out of style and they always look professional. Number 2. Ignoring audio quality You can have the most amazing visuals, but if your audio is bad, it's a total mess. Believe it or not, people are actually more forgiving of not so perfect visuals than sound. So do yourself a favor, don't rely on that built-in mic on your camera. It's worth getting a solid external microphone. And always, always check that your sound levels are even and there's not too much background noise. Number 3. Jumping between different styles Alright, here's the deal. You have got to stay consistent. I know it's tempting to throw in all sorts of styles and effects in one video. But honestly, it can really throw off your viewers. Find a vibe that works for what you are showing and just roll with it for the whole video. It makes a huge difference. Number 4. Not organizing clips You absolutely have to get your clips organized before you even think about editing. Sorting out your clips ahead of time is gonna save you a whole bunch of headaches. It helps streamline everything. You know you are not endlessly scrolling trying to find the right clip. Plus, when everything's neatly organized, there's less chance you'll overlook some killer footage that you absolutely should include in your final project. You'll thank yourself later when you are deep into editing and everything is just a click away. Number 5. Over relying on templates Templates are a great place to start, don't get me wrong, but you can't just use them as is and call it a day. You have got to tweak them to make them fit your video's unique vibe. If you just slap on a template without customizing it, your project's gonna look super generic and we don't want that, do we? So go ahead, use those templates as a starting point, but make sure you add your own flair to really make it yours. Number 6. Forgetting to color correct You know how sometimes when you are filming, the lighting can switch up on you. Maybe a cloud passed by or the sun started setting. Well, that can throw your colors all over the place. So once you are editing, it's super important to do some color correction. This way, all your clips have a consistent look. And hey, while we are on this topic, there's also something called color grading. It's not the same as color correction. Grading's more about setting the vibe or the mood for your video. Think of it like adding a unique filter to make everything feel just right. And speaking of color grading, we have put together an awesome pack of over 100 color grading LUTs. And guess what? They are totally free. Just hit up the link in the video description. Number 7. Not paying attention to pacing Pacing is everything in a video. You ever watched something and just zoned out because it dragged on forever? Or you blinked and missed a quick scene? We have all been there. It's all about finding that sweet spot with the rhythm of your video. Now, I'm not saying every scene has to move at the same pace. Nah, it's more about making sure everything flows and feels natural. Keep it engaging, keep it smooth and your viewers will be right there with you. Number 8. Neglecting Storytelling at the end of the day, editing is all about telling a story. You could have the most jaw-dropping shots, but if they aren't pushing the story forward, they are just pretty pictures. So whenever you are in the zone, cutting and trimming, always ask yourself, is this serving my story? Remember, every cut should bring something to the table and push that narrative. Number 9. Not using keyboard shortcuts Video editing is a time-consuming process, but if you want to get things done quicker, one of the best things you can do is learn the keyboard shortcuts for the software you are using. Once you get the hang of it, not only will you work faster, but everything will just flow better. You'll be able to make your videos way more easily and they'll turn out better too. Number 10. Not reviewing the final cut multiple times after hours of editing, you might feel like wrapping up the project fast, but doing that might make you miss some mistakes. Always go over your work a few times and if you can, get someone else to check it. Someone new might spot things you don't see. And those were the 10 pitfalls every newbie video editor should watch out for. If you found this video helpful, be sure to hit that like button and subscribe for more editing related content. Don't forget to grab your free pack of over 100 color grading LEDs from the link below. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.